Hello. Hello. Hi, I'm Emily, and you are Ramzan? Yes, my name is Ramzan. Very nice to meet you. Uh, and what are you? Yes. Um, and you are practicing, wanting to practice a uh, conversation? Uh, yes. Yes. I am interested to practice uh, conversation because uh, uh, currently I'm working on uh, to understand the different people from different countries. Oh, cool. Yes. I like it. Okay. So Very what's good. your profession? This is what I do. I'm a, a an English as a foreign language teacher on Cambly. So you mean that uh, uh, you did the graduation and do, you started the career in Cambly? That I'm sorry, I couldn't hear you. The the service talk, cut out. I'm talking about that. This was your dream to uh, teach on Cambly. My dream. Um. Yes. No. Not exactly. Uh, I graduated with a degree in psychology and then uh, like what a major in psychology and then uh -huh. a major in art, like interdisciplinary art. Um, I wanted to be a art therapist. I don't know if mm -hmm. you've heard of that. Yes, I have. But, um, and in the United States, um, you have to to be a therapist you you have to get your master's degree mm -hmm. so you do the four years and then you do two more years for the master's degree and then you do um like maybe a year of kind of of doing hours basically like practice hours um mm -hmm. so like you're not officially licensed until after that Okay. And when, yeah, it's a lot, but it's good because if you're a therapist, you need to make sure that you're able to work well with people and people who come to you. But when I graduated, mm -hmm. I wanted to take some time off because I was really tired of school. <laughs> so I haven't gone back to school yet, but um, in the in this time that I have not been in school, I found um, teaching like I I liked teaching another language. Well, I mean my language, but um, I like it because I spent a lot of time learning another language. I I since two thousand sixteen. I started uh, learning Spanish. Mm -hmm. So I really liked what that did for me and how it changed my life, learning another language. And I've been passionate about being a teacher for others. Okay. So, so you mean that you completely uh, left the profession which was before, right? Um, no, because I had, I had taken jobs in that field. After I got out of college, I took some some psychology related positions. Um, so I I worked in the field, but then I decided last year that I wanted to try teaching. So okay, so from last year onwards, you are teaching online and also learning uh, other languages so that uh, you could teach. Um. Yeah. Yeah. I had. Yeah, yeah, we can we can say like that. That makes sense. So currently you have the expertise on two languages like Spanish and English, right? Yeah, I'm I would say I'm 75% with Spanish, 75. So that's pretty good. Yes. But it's not completely. <laughs> and uh, so I'm, I'm if working. you if you are speaking Spanish so at that time, someone can judge you that you don't know Spanish or maybe you are not the native speaker. Um, actually, someone recently told me that she didn't realize that I didn't speak, um, that my original language is English. So I guess I'm I'm pretty good. 
Okay, so you mean that after having that feedback, you thought that yes, you are uh, having enough knowledge in Spanish, right? Yeah. Yeah, that's great. So uh, can you please tell me about your culture that what is the best thing which you found in your culture that is really beautiful and you think that because of that you are feeling really amazing? Something really like good about my country, you said? Yes. Um, to be honest, uh, that's a good question. I'm these days i'm i'm not a big fan of the united states mm. why? do what why why um it's a long long list of reasons um but i guess something that i can appreciate that I learned from growing up in the United States is mm -hmm. that I have a belief system that says that there's always a way. Like when there's an obstacle, I've grown up to believe that there's some way to, f to make it work. And, you know, and I can, I can find that by, searching for it and so, so you, learned, you learned this skill from your parents or from teachers or who yeah both okay both yeah and i i think that has benefited my life for sure because i have i have that mentality that if i'm in a problem or if i see if i'm trying to do something and there's a lot of like obstacles that I don't give up. I keep trying to find a way to make make it happen. That's something that is positive, I think. I am also inspired of uh, inspired by John Cena. He has also the great quotation that never give up, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, <laughs> and I, I'm following that. Yeah, it's it's so true there's to me there's always a way you just have to put in your effort and your time and you'll find it yes of course so any other thing any other thing about culture, culture um any other thing that this is a good this is good you're making me think what about what oh since i gave one while i think you give me one about your country yes in my country uh, i had the dream of living alone in a room where i would have all the facilities like internet computer i would able to uh, work in an environment which is quite silent so of course i achieved that I was working in a company and then I quit the job. I started my own work, started freelancing. Now I have different clients. I have my own projects. So in that way, I am uh, comfortable with the environment which I am living with. And yes. in the culture, uh, I uh, we have a neat and clean environment here. I mean, there is not... Uh, okay. Because yes and we have snowfall we have greenery and uh, in most of the cases you will find that kashmir this place is also called as the paradise on earth so you can imagine that oh. how beautiful it would be and i am living there so yes that's why i am grateful for this thing wow that's awesome very yes. i'm happy for you Yes, yeah, have, you... Uh, a few seconds. So please mention your second second point. <laughs> um, yeah, I it's it's hard. It's really hard. Maybe if I think of it, I'll I'll message you. I'll message you. But right now, the United States is not my favorite place for sure. If you hear about you know what's in the news and everything. Okay. Sorry, sorry for that. 
<laughs> well, thank you. And uh, if I'm 